بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم یا اللہ او ہی ہوں دا ڈپکشن آف دا ڈسکرائبرز فیلز ٹو ڈسکرائب او ہی بیانڈ ہوم پاسز ناٹ دا ہوپ آف دا ہوپرز او ہی وتھ ہوم از ناٹ لاسٹ دا ویج آف دا گڈ ڈوئرز او ہی ہو از دی الٹیمیٹ آبجیکٹ آف دا فیئر آف دا ورشپرز او ہی ہو از دی اٹموسٹ لیمٹ آف دا ڈریڈ آف دا گاڈ فیئرنگ This is the station of him whose sins have passed from hand to hand. Offenses reigns have led him on and shaitan has gained mastery over him. He fell short of what you have commanded through neglect and he pursued what you have prohibited in delusion. Like one ignorant of your power over him or one who denies the bounty of your beneficence towards him until when the eye of guidance was opened for him and the clouds of blindness were dispelled he thought that through which he had wronged himself and reflected upon that in which he had opposed his lord he saw his vast disobedience as vast and his great opposition as great so turned to you hoping in you and ashamed before you and he directed his beseeching towards you having trust in you he repaired to you in his longing with certitude and he went straight to you in fear with sincerity his longing was devoid of every object of longing but you and his fright departed from every object of fear but you So he stood before you pleading, his eyes turned towards the ground in humbleness, his head bowed before your might and lowliness, he revealed to you in meekness those secrets of his which you know better than he. He numbered for you in humility those sins of his which you count better than he. He sought help from you before the dreadful into which he has fallen in your knowledge and the ugly which has disgraced him in your judgment the sins whose pleasures have turned their backs and gone and whose evil consequences have stayed and stuck fast he will not deny your justice my god and if you punish him nor will he consider your pardon great and if you pardon him and have mercy upon him for you are the generous god for whom the forgiveness of great sins is nothing great ya allah so here i am i have come to you obeying your command for you have commanded supplication and asking the fulfillment of your promise for you have promised to respond you have said supplicate to me and i will respond to you ya allah so bless muhammad and his household meets me with your forgiveness just as i have met you with my confession lift me up from the fatal infirmities of sin just as i have let myself down before you and cover me with your covering just as you have shown no haste to take vengeance on me Ya Allah make firm my intention to obey you strengthen my insight in worshiping you give me the success of works which will wash away the defilement of offenses and take me when you take me the creed of your prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wasallam Ya Allah I repent to you in this my station from my sins great and small my evil deeds inward and outward my lapses past and recent with the repentance of one who does not tell himself that he might disobey or secretly think that he might return to an offense You have said my God in the firm text of your book that you accept repentance from your servants pardon evil deeds and love the repenters so accept my repentance as you have promised pardon my evil deeds as you have guaranteed and make obligatory towards me your love as you have stipulated to you my lord belongs my stipulation that i will not return to what is disliked by you my guarantee that i will not go back to what you blame and my covenant that i will stay away from the acts of disobedience to you ya allah you know better what i have done so forgive me what you know and turn me through your power to what you love Ya Allah counted against me are claims that stay in my memory and claims that I have forgotten while all of them remain in your eye that does not sleep 
and your knowledge that does not forget. So compensate their owners, lighten their load upon me, lift up their weight from me, and preserve me from approaching their like. Ya Allah, but I cannot be faithful to my repentance without your preservation, nor can I refrain from offenses without your strength. So strengthen me with a sufficient strength and attend to me with a defending preservation. Ya Allah, if any servant repents to you while in your knowledge of the unseen, he will break his repentance and return to his sin and offense. I seek refuge in you from being like that. So make this my repentance, a repentance after which I will need no repentance, and a repentance which will obligate the erasing of what is gone by the safety in what remains. Ya Allah, I ask pardon from you for my ignorance, and I ask you to disregard my evil acts. So join me to the shelter of your mercy through graciousness, and cover me with the covering of your well-being through bounteousness. Ya Allah, I repent to you from everything opposed to your will or far from your love. The thoughts of my heart, the glances of my eye, the tales of my tongue with the repentance through which each bodily part will by itself stay safe from ill consequences with you and remain secure from your painful penalties feared by the transgressors. Ya Allah, so have mercy on my being alone before you, the pounding of my heart in dread of you, the trembling of my limbs in awe of you. My sins, my God, have stood me in the station of degradation in your courtyard. If I remain silent, no one will speak for me. If I seek an intercessor, I'm not worthy for intercession. Ya Allah, bless Muhammad and his household. Make your generosity intercede for my offenses. Follow up my evil deeds with your pardon. Repay me not with the punishment that is my proper repayment. Spread over me your graciousness. Wrap me in your covering and do with me what is done by a mighty man. When a lowly slave pleads to him and he shows him mercy or a rich man. When a poor slave submits himself and he raises him to wealth. Ya Allah, I have no protector against you. So let your might be my protector. I have no intercessor with you. So let your bounty be my intercessor. My offenses have set me quaking. So let your pardon give me security. Not all that I have said rises up from my ignorance of my evil footsteps or forgetfulness of my blameworthy acts in the past. But in order that your heaven and those within it and your earth and those upon it may hear the remorse which I have professed to you and the repentance through which I have sought asylum with you. Then perhaps one of them through your mercy may show mercy upon my evil situation or be seized by the tender for my evil state. There may come from him for my sake a supplication to which you give ear more than to my supplication, or an intercession surer with you than my intercession, through which I may be delivered from your wrath and attain to your good pleasure. Ya Allah, if remorse is a repentance towards you, then I am the most remorseful of the remorseful. If refraining from disobedience is a turning back to you, then I am the first of those who turn back. If praying for forgiveness alleviates sins, surely I am one of those who pray for your forgiveness. Ya Allah, as you have commanded repentance and guaranteed acceptance, as you have urged supplication and promised to respond, so also bless Muhammad and his household and accept my repentance and return me not to the returning place of disappointment in your mercy. Surely you are ever turning towards the sinners, all compassionate towards the offenders who turn back. Ya Allah, bless Muhammad and his household, just as you have guided us by him. Bless Muhammad and his household, just as you have rescued us through him. Bless Muhammad and his household, with a blessing that will intercede for us on the day of resurrection, the day of neediness towards you. You are powerful over everything, and that is easy for you.
اللهم صل على محمد وعلى محمد وعجل فرجه